A, B, C, one, two, three. Okay, I was checking it. Hi, right, good evening everyone. Welcome to Creek Box TV. I'm Alan Handley. We are getting ready for a big region 2A game over here in Ashburn, Georgia, where the Clinch County Panthers have traveled up 75 all the way to Turner County to play the Turner County Titans. We'll have the girls game fixing to tip off here in 60 seconds. They're fixing to do the lineup. And we're getting ready. It's a rough place, a hard place to win over here in Turner County. Lady Panthers coming in undefeated in region play. I think Turner County Titans, they may have one loss. Lady Panthers come in with a 8-3 and three record on the year. Panthers will be in their black uniforms with red numbers. Turner will have their white uniforms on with orange numbers. Turner County has made it to the Sweet 16 in girls probably the last seven, eight years. Number two, Fowler will be jumping against Dorsey. And we're getting ready to play. There it is, Fowler get the tip. Number five, Lawson with the ball. Now then 11, give it up to Collins. Collins trying to throw it away. Good job by the Panthers, getting back on defense. All right, Talbert will bring it in. Cupcake down the court, right back to Talbert. Talbert back over to Asia, down to Dorsey. Dorsey looking. Back to Dean. Dean drives to the basket. Up and in. Good shot by Dean. Two to nothing. Panthers on top. Here comes Turner. There's a steal by Talbert. She'll get it. Drives down. Lays it up. Missed the layup. Turner County right back with it. Wilson with the ball. Trying to throw it over to Collins. And Collins couldn't hold on to it. So that'll be a turnover. Here come the Panthers. Tomka says, let's go, girls. Best, wish, best wishes from Germany. We miss you, darling. Wish you was out here on the court with the Panthers. Panthers get it down low to Dorsey. She'll throw it up. Got it off the backboard. Good shot by Dorsey. Four to nothing. Panthers on top. 
They're going to throw it over to Fowler. Fowler, long shot. Can't get it to go. Dean with the rebound. Here come the Panthers. Dean will go behind her back, dribble down. She'll give it up to Talbert. Talbert all the way across to Dorsey. Dorsey, 12-footer, can't get it to go. Rebound, Dean. Good pass back door to Cupcake up and in. Six to nothing. Panthers on top now. Here comes Turner now. They get it across half court. Almost stole there by Asia. Good block by Dorsey. Panthers have it. Here they come. Out to Dean. Dean running. Lays it up. Left-handed up and in. And Turner County said, I've seen enough. We need a timeout. We'll take one, too. We'll be back in 30 seconds. Located in Homerville, Georgia, the Averitt House offers the finest selection of bespoke home decor, thoughtfully curated gifts, fresh and permanent florals, jewelry, and bridal registries. Open Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. with limited shopping hours on Wednesday and Saturday from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. The Averitt House is the ultimate shopping destination with gifts for him and her. And then along came Walker Jones. At Walker Jones, new 2024 Chevy trucks are arriving daily. And the 23s must go. Like this beautiful iridescent white pearl tri-coat Chevy Silverado 1500 High Country. Price to move. At Walker Jones is the home of the lifetime warranty at no. All right, everybody. Welcome back to Creek Box. Clinch County leading eight to nothing over Turner here. Two minutes into the game. 12 with the ball. That's Wilson. Almost lost it. Good defense by the Panthers. Long shot by Fowler off the back of the rim. Lost him with the rebound. Back out to Wilson. And that'll be a travel and that'll be a turnover. Panthers have it now. Cupcake will bring it in. Got it to Talbert. And here come the Panthers. Back over to Asia. Asia down low to Dorsey. Dorsey dribbling around. Back door to Cupcake up and in again. Good shot. 10 to nothing. Panthers on top. Lawson with the ball. She'll give it up to Wilson. You can never have a big enough lead over here in Turner. Coach Doreen got good job by Dean. Doreen was napping on the sideline on the bench. <laughs> She's awake now. <laughs> I'll hear about that. All right. Turner got it down low. Dorsey, good defense. They'll kick it back out to two. Fowler with the shot, and she'll get it. Three-point shot there by Fowler. Ten to three now. Here come the Panthers. Over to Cupcake. Back out to Talbert. Asia with the ball now. Asia with a long one. Off the rim. Can't get it to go. Fowler with the rebound. Here comes Turner. She'll kick it all the way back out. There's 12 shooting the ball off the back of the rim. That was Wilson. Rebound Dorsey. Dorsey throws it out to Talbert. Talbert will draw a foul. They're going to call it on 12, I think. And that's who it is. That's Wilson. That'll be her first. 10 to three, five minutes to play here in the first quarter. It's a little chilly in here tonight. I'll tell you what, that wind, it temperature is dropping. First shot up and in by Talbert. Good shot. 11 to three now. Asia's in a different number tonight. She's in number 22. Second one on the way off the back of the rim. Dorsey with the rebound. Panthers keep it. Back to Talbert. Talbert back out to Cupcake. She'll throw it up. Can't get it. Dorsey has it. Dorsey with a 15-footer off the rim. Can't get it. Finally, Turner comes down with it. That was Harden with the rebound. Panthers have her trapped. Good job. Turner will get out of it. Driving in. Can't get it to go. Dean with the steal, and here she comes. From one end to the other, lays it up left-handed, couldn't get it to go. Wilson with the rebound. There's another steal by the Panthers, Asia this time. She'll tip it over to Talbert. Talbert looking for some help. She'll throw up a 12-footer, can't get it. Dorsey with the rebound. A long shot by Asia, that'll be short. Fowler with the rebound, here comes Turner. 
Fowler all the way to the basket, lays it up, can't get it to go. And that'll be a turnover. They said she traveled. They're going to call that on Harding, so the Panthers will take over. Four minutes to play in the first. We're up over 700 people watching now. Richard Self says, let's go, girls. Here comes Talbert. Asia has it over to Cupcake. Cupcake will pull up, 10-footer, can't get it to go. Mingo had it. She'll throw it. Oh, that was Magby, excuse me, with the rebound. Good pass by Talbert. Magby will throw it up. She'll draw a foul. That'll put Magby at the free throw line for the Panthers. Fowler with the foul. That'll be her first. Magby at the line. First shot on the way. She'll miss it. Stevens will check in the game now. Asia will take a break. Second shot on the way from Magby. Got it. Good shot by Magby. 12 to 3 now. Panthers lead. Turner will get it in to Edwards. And she traveled. That'll be another Turner turnover. All right, Talbert with the ball. She'll get it in to Stevens. Stevens bringing it down the court. Over to Cupcake. Back to Dorsey in the middle. Dorsey, 12-footer. Got it! Good shot by Dorsey. There's a pass over to Edwards. Edwards trying to throw it. We got a, nope, she traveled. That'll be another turnover. Morris will check in the game now for the Panthers. Cupcake will take a break. Magby will bring it in. Stevens bringing it down the court for the Panthers. Got it to Dorsey. Dorsey looking, looking, kicks it out to Talbert. Good move by Talbert, good pass. Got it over to Morris. Morris lost it. Here comes Turner now. Lost him with the ball. Got it to Edwards, Edwards under the basket. Got it, good shot by Edwards. 14 to five now. Stevens with the ball, over to Morris. Morris with a three, off the back of the rim. A rebound in there, number 20, that's Harding. Jump ball. Magby tied it up. She wasn't going to let go of it. Panthers have the possession. Dean coming back in the game now. Dorsey will take a break. 2.29 to play in the first. Morris will bring it in. Dean with the ball now. She'll hand it off to Talbert. Talbert driving in. Six-footer got it to go. 16 to five. Lawson with the ball. Fowler has it now, and they'll throw it away. Almost got Coach Chase that time. Wilson for the Panthers getting ready to check in, number 15. Coach Chase hollering a play to set the offense up. Here we go. Magby back over to Stevens. Stevens looking long three in and out. It wrapped around the rim. Rebound in there by Magby. She'll put it up and in. Good shot. 18 to five. Martin with the ball. She's driving in. She'll throw it up. We got a foul. On number 15, that'll be Wilson. That'll be her first. Turner has it, trying to get it under the goal. Good pass, got it to number 20. She'll miss it. That was Harding. Turner keeps it, long three. Off the backboard and in. That's Lawson with a three-pointer. 
18 to 8. Looks like we got a timeout, so we'll take another break. We'll be back in just a second. Don't forget your little ones this holiday season at our newest store, The Little Averett, offering a large selection of children's clothing, toys, paper goods, and baby registries with brands such as Proper Peony, Beaufort Bonnet, Feltman Brothers, Noodle and Boo, and Mary Mary. Mary Averett and The Little Averett are open Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. with limited shopping hours Wednesday and Saturday from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Come join us for the merriest shopping experience in the south. All right, everybody, welcome back. Panthers have the ball. Turner has jumped into a little press. One minute and 25 seconds to play. Good job by Dean all the way to the basket. Six points tonight here in the first quarter for Dean. 20 to eight now. Wilson with the ball for Turner. She'll make it. Good shot by Wilson. Panthers have it. We're going to have a foul. That's going to be on number three, I think. That is. That's number three. That's Martin. That'll be her first. 20 to 10, Panthers lead. No, excuse me. That's on the Panthers number three, Magby. That'll be her first. First shot up and in. Good job there. By Turner. Edwards. Oh, that's Martin shooting the ball. Second free throw on the way. In and out. Dorsey with the rebound. Oh, almost a steal. Dean will save it. Here come the Panthers. Knock that about. No, we're going to have a foul. That's going to be on 12 for Turner. That's Wilson. That'll be her second. She has two points tonight for Turner. 20 to 11. Panthers leading here in the first. Cupcake with the ball. Got it to Wilson. Wilson back to Cupcake. She'll throw it up. Can't get it. Turner with the rebound. Here they come. And she traveled. That was number two, Fowler. Another Turner turnover. Kimberly Moore says, let's go Big Red. Panthers with it. Talbert. Oh. Let's see. We're going to have a foul here on number three. That's Martin. That'll be her first. Fifty-one seconds to play in the first. Panthers lead twenty to eleven. Cupcake will bring it in. Trying to get it to Dorsey. Panthers will turn it over. That was Collins with it. Long pass to number four. Up and in. Good job by Edwards. Twenty to thirteen now. Dorsey with the ball. She lost it. Turner has it. Edwards with it again. She'll dribble through, trying to. Dean will steal it, and here come the Panthers. Over to Cupcake. Cupcake misses it. Dorsey with the rebound, up and in. 22-13. 15 seconds to play now here in the first. Long shot there by Fowler. Panthers with the rebound. Talbert, crossover, got it. Good move by Talbert. 24 to 13, two, one, long shot, no chance. So after one quarter, Clinch County 24, Turner County 13. We'll be back in 60 seconds. Crafted with you in mind, our homes are a blend of style and warmth, turning dreams into reality. Whether you're seeking mobile, modular, or manufactured homes, Clayton Homes of Waycross has the perfect fit for you. Join the thousands who've chosen comfort, chosen quality, chosen Clayton Homes. Call today to speak with one of our experienced home consultants, 912-284-1728. We also offer land home packages, Clayton Homes of Waycross. Be 
Mary this holiday season at the Mary Averett, located in the heart of downtown Homerville, Georgia. The largest Christmas decor and holiday showroom south of Atlanta. Come experience the magic of the holiday season with brands such as Christopher Radko, Mark Roberts, and Glitterville, with an extensive selection of tree trimmings, tabletop decor, and holiday themed gifts. The Mary Averett has everything you need to make every day a holiday. All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. I'm Adeline Hanley. Got my buddy Daniel Munzo up here running the camera. Turner with the ball. Panthers with the lead. There's a steal by Cupcake. She's going to take it all the way, lays it up and in. Six points tonight for Cupcake. She had four in the first. 26-13 now. They'll get it down low to Fowler. She'll step back. Long one can't get it. Dorsey with the rebound. Asia with the ball. Turner in a man-to-man -man now. They'll lay it out there. Good job by Asia to get it to Talbert. Oh, and they just moved at the wrong time. Harding with the steal. Here comes Turner. Lays it up. No good. Now knock it out of bounds. We're going to have a foul. Twenty-three. That's Dorsey. That'll be her first. Trying to see what numbers at the free throw line. I can't tell. First shot up and in. Second one on the way off the back of the rim. Knocked out of bounds. That was Harding with the basket. Talbert, oh, good job. Talbert got it out somehow to Dean. Dean throws it up off the backboard, up and in. Dean with eight points tonight. She had six in the first. 28-14. Oh, they're going to call that on Dean. That'll be her first. Coach Chase didn't like the call. You can only bite your lip and move on. Turner has the ball. Edwards will bring it in for Turner. She'll get it in over to Lawson. Lawson throws it all the way across to Fowler. Driving in, reverse layup, no good. We got a foul. They're going to call that on number 10. That'll be Cupcake. That'll be her first. That'll put Fowler at the free throw line for Turner. First shot up and in. Good shot by Fowler. 28-15 now. Panthers lead. 6.50 to go in the first half. Second one on the way. Couldn't get the roll. Dorsey with the rebound. Cupcake with it. Good job getting it across. Got it to Asia. Asia over to Dean. Dean with a three-pointer. Off the backboard. Can't get it. Dorsey rebound up and in. Eight points tonight for Dorsey. And one. I don't know who they called the foul on there. Dorsey trying to make it a three-point play. Off the rim, can't get it. Asia fighting for it. Dean has it. Up and in. Dean with the basket. 32-15 to 15 now. Biggest lead of the night for the Panthers. There's Dean slapped it. Almost got it. Oh, and that'll be a travel. That was Edwards trying to go to the basket. Now throw it over to Asia. Down to Dorsey. Dorsey making a move. Oh, and they're going to draw a foul. She slapped Dorsey. That's number 20. That's Harding. 
That'll put Dorsey back at the free throw line. First free throw up and in. Good job by Dorsey. Nine now check in now for the Panthers. Second shot, Dorsey off the rim. Dean with the rebound. She let it roll down. Talbert picks it up. Got it to Dorsey. Pass to Nana. Up and in. Good job by Nana. 35-15 now. 20-point lead by the Panthers. Number one, she'll kick it back over to three. Good shot there by Martin with the basket. Here comes Talbert now. Got it to Asia. Asia back to Nana. Asia with the ball again. Trying to get it to Nana. She saved it over to Dorsey off the backboard. Couldn't get it to go. Fowler with the rebound. Here comes Turner. Got it to Lawson. Lawson lost it out of bounds. Panthers helped her. They'll keep possession. 5.37 to play in the first half. Edwards with the ball. She'll dribble through. All the way across over to Lawson. Back to Williams. There's a steal by the Panthers. Here comes Dean. Dean, spin move, nowhere to go. We got a foul on number five. That's going to be Lawson. That'll be her first. Panthers will keep it. Stevens in the game now. Dean taking a break. Stevens with the ball. Got it over to Asia. Asia trying to get it to Dorsey. Fowler will knock it out of bounds. Nana bringing it in for the Panthers now. Trying to get it to Asia, knocked out of bounds again. Nana to Dorsey. Dorsey back to Stevens, over to Nana. Back to Dorsey, spin move in the paint, good move, got it! Good move by Dorsey. 37-17 now. Turner needing a basket. Good defense by the Panthers. There's another steal. Stevens has it. Got it to Asia. Asia across half court. Dribbles down. Got it over to Nana. Nana looking. Got it to Dorsey under the basket. Dorsey off the backboard. Can't get it. Got her own rebound though. Stevens with a long shot. It'll come up short. Turner has it. Here comes Fowler now for Turner. In the paint, she'll pull up. Got it. Good shot by Fowler. 37-19. Turner stays in that man-to-man. -man full court press. Talbert. Good pass to 9 back Backdoor. Got it again. 39-19. Panthers playing some basketball tonight here in Ashburn. I'll throw up another one, Turner Will. She'll miss it. Dorsey with another rebound. Here comes Stevens now. Got it to Nana. Let her too much. Nana saved it, though. Got it to Asia. Stevens with a three off the rim. Here comes Turner. Dorsey with the steal. They'll steal it right back. Turner drives into the basket, lays it up and in. That was Lawson. 39-21, we got a timeout. We'll take one, two. We'll be back in 30 seconds. At Richards in Homerville, Georgia, you'll find the best meats and seafood anywhere around. For all your holiday needs, parties, and special events, we provide catering that will make the occasion one your guests will never forget. 
whether it's a wedding, company party, political event, or convention from Savannah to Atlanta and parts beyond. Call Gregory to schedule Richard's Catering Service or to purchase their famous barbecue sauce today. 912-487-5822. All right, here we go. Here come the Panthers. Colbert with the ball. Dribbling down, she'll give it to Asia. Back to Morris. Morris traveled. That'll be a Panther turnover. 319 to play in the first half. 39-21. It's been all clinch. Turner needing a couple of baskets now. Edwards driving in, lays it up and in. Good shot by Edwards. 39-23, they stay in a press. Panthers dribble through it. Talbert sees the opening all the way. Good job there by Fowler. Got the block and the steal, and they throw it away. Dean checking back in for the Panthers. Asia will take a break. Morris will give it back up to Talbert. Nana with the ball. Nana dribbles across half court. Back over to Morris. Morris will give it up to Magby. Talbert with the ball. Got it to Dean. Dean in the paint. Turnaround jumper. Can't get it to go. Dorsey slapping that out. Magby slapping at it. Here comes Turner now. Edwards with the ball. She'll give it up to Lawson. Got it down low to Harding. Harding back outside. Long three won't go. Magby with the rebound. Here come the Panthers. Over to Dean. Dean with a three. Off the back of the rim. Turner with the rebound now. Here comes Fowler. Dean with the steal. They're trying to get a bounce pass. Dean steals it. Good. Oh, man. Almost. Had a great play behind her back trying to hit Talbert coming to the basket. We're over a 1,000 people watching right now here live on Creek Box. We appreciate everybody tuning in. Double header tonight on Creek Box. The girls are going to get it in first, and we'll have the boys up later. Edwards with the ball. They'll get it over to Wilson. Wilson almost lost it, good save. Got it back to Edwards. Edwards with the shot, can't get it to go. We got a foul. And that's going to be on number three, Magby, and that'll be her second. Edwards at the free throw line now. First shot, can't get it to go. Dorsey, Cupcake, and Asia check in. Nana, Magby, and Morris will take a break. Second shot on the way for Edwards. Got it. Pretty shot. 39-24. Here come the Panthers now. Talbert dribbling through two of them. Asia saves it. Got it to Cupcake. Cupcake trying to get it to Dean. Dean has it. She'll throw one up. She's going to draw a foul on 12. That's Wilson. That'll be her third. See what the coach is going to do. They're going to leave her in. That'll put Dean at the free throw line. First shot up off the back of the rim. Sanders will check in now. For Turner. Second shot on the way by Dean. Got it. 40 to 24. Turner with the ball. Sanders will give it back up to Lawson. Lawson over to Edwards. Back to Lawson. Lawson driving in, throws it up. Can't get it. Turner with the rebound. She'll go up. Can't get it. Cupcake with the rebound. Here come the Panthers. She's going to slow it down. Good job by Asia. 
Got it to Dean. Talbert with a three, overshot it. Turner has it as Lawson with the ball. She'll miss it, rebound in there by Edwards. She'll put it up and in. 40 to 26 now. 43 seconds. Talbert to do a layup, can't get it. Fowler with another rebound. Long pass out to Lawson. Lawson can't get it to go. She's going to draw a foul. 22, that'll be Asia. That'll be her first. 35 seconds to play here in the first half. Lawson's first shot up and in. Edwards will take a break now. Collins back in the game. Fowler taking a break. Got it. Got them both. Good job. By Lawson. Dean trying to get it to Dorsey. Panthers turn it over again. Turner trying to get back in this game. 40 to 28. They were just down by 19. Now it's 12. Lawson driving. Can't get it to go. Another rebound by Turner. Up and in. Out with by Lawson. 40 to 30. Knocked out of bounds. Panthers keep it. Nana in the game now for the Panthers. Dean will take a break. Steven back over to Cupcake. Good pass, Cupcake to Steven. The greater pass down low. Nana can't get it to go, but she'll draw a foul. Now to put Nana at the free throw line. First one, she'll miss off the back of the rim. Second shot on the way by Nana. Can't get it to go. Dorsey with a big rebound. She can't hold on to it. That was Collins took it away. We got a jump ball. Panthers will keep possession. Fowler will check back in for Turner. Dorsey with a 12 footer and got it. Good job by Dorsey. And that's it. So the first half, Panthers lead by 12, 42 to 30. We'll be back in nine minutes. Enjoy the Pizza Inn All Day Buffet with more than 40 items featuring salads, pasta, desserts, and pizzas located at 501 South City Boulevard in Waycross. Whether you want to dine in or take out, the Pizza Inn and Waycross is the place to go for wonderful pizza and salad bar. Call 912-809-2411 for takeout orders or drop by for a grand dining experience. The Pizza Inn, Waycross, Georgia. Need a break? Need some quality family time? Get over to Camping World of Valosta right now. Camping World of Valosta can put you in an RV for as little as $5 per day. Make your dreams of camping with your family or a road trip across the USA reality. Experience the freedom that comes with the purchase of an RV from Camping World of Valosta. Whether it is a purchase of an RV, maintenance, service, or camping supplies, Camping World of Valosta can meet all of your RV needs. So don't put your dreams off another day.
As part of our commitment to convenient health care and the highest quality in pharmacy services, Clinch Memorial Pharmacy offers three convenient ways for you to get your prescriptions. We offer an easy walk-in location near the ER entrance. Our pharmacist is on site, ready to help if you have any questions. With our curbside pickup options, we will bring the prescriptions to your car. Just call ahead. We also offer a delivery service for prescriptions for patients in Clinch County. Make the change today. Call 912-470-2359 to learn more. Big Daddy's Bar & Grill, located at 31 East Dame Avenue, Homerville, has the best food and atmosphere anywhere around. Big Daddy's Bar & Grill has a great lunch and dinner menu with a wide variety of your favorite food including the perfectly grilled steak, wraps, sandwiches, chicken and salads. Big Daddy's in Homerville also has your favorite drink to go with your meal. Drop by Big Daddy's in Homerville, you won't be disappointed. Big Daddy's Bar & Grill on 84 in Homerville for the best food and drinks around. At Burt CPAs, helping small businesses with their accounting needs is our business. We have offices in Homerville, Waycross, Alma, and Baxley. Burt's professionals are ready to serve you no matter your location. We are your team for accounting, bookkeeping, tax, and financial advice. In Homerville, call firm partner Adam Toll. Napa Auto Parts 255 South Church Street, Homerville, Georgia is your one stop for all auto, truck parts, tools, equipment, and accessories. Napa Auto Parts has been a name you can trust in Homerville for many years. If Napa does not have the item you need in stock, the friendly, knowledgeable, and efficient personnel at Napa Auto Parts will have it for you the next day. Open at 7 a.m. Monday through Friday and 8 a.m. on Saturday, Napa Auto Parts in Homerville is a name you can trust. Napa Auto Parts in Homerville. From our swing bed service to our primary care practice, and now our new retail pharmacy, Clinch Memorial Hospital is equipped to provide our community the best care right here at home. Dr. Angkor is Clinch Memorial's physician and offers quality care at Clinch Family Practice, where our community can also enjoy spa services. At Clinch Memorial Pharmacy, patients can fulfill their prescriptions conveniently with our curbside pickup services. We also provide the COVID vaccine. Give us a call at 912 470-2359 to schedule yours today. This is Alan Hanley, and I want to tell you about Dre's Snack Shack. Dre specializes in chicken wings, barbecue, sausage, hot dogs, hamburgers, salads, and a variety of other mouth-watering menu items. So y'all come on down and see Dre at Dre's Snack Shack. He can handle all your catering needs also. The good thing is he stays open late at night after the game. So please come in and see Dre at Dre Snack Shack. For the best pizza and wings in town any day of the week, check out Huey's One Stop in Homerville. Drop by, fuel up, and let Mr. Nick Patel and staff serve you some mouth-watering pizza and wings that you won't soon forget. Or just take that favorite pizza and box of wings home. Call 912-487-2338 to order your pizza and wings every Friday night after the game. Huey's One Stop, 193 Church Street, Homerville. Homerville Jewelers in Homerville is your headquarters for bridal and baby registry. Our newly remodeled location has that special gift for the bride and groom or that perfect gift for the new baby. Homerville Jewelers has the gifts that are suited for any special occasion, whatever it might be. Homerville Jewelers can perform jewelry repairs and offers a variety of diamonds, gold, sterling silver, watches, and necklaces. No need to shop out of town. Homerville Jewelers can supply all your gift and jewelry needs. Let Kathy Townsend and staff serve you at Homerville Jewelers, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. Dairy Queen is a proud part of our local communities and is cheering our sports teams on to championship seasons. 
drop by before and after the game to say hello to Mr. Ash and his entire crew and enjoy the full Dairy Queen menu including our famous grilled burgers, artisan style sandwiches, and chicken strips. Cool off with our renowned smoothies, slushies, malts, and iced coffees. Try our fabulous desserts and take an ice cream cake home for that special occasion or just to treat the family. Dine in or take out at Dairy Queen locations in Homerville, Blackshire, Folkestone, and Fernandina Beach. See you at the DQ. Lee Engineering and Construction Company in DuPont, Georgia has been a part of the community since 1935 and is proud to support Clinch County Athletics. The prayer of the entire Lee Engineering family is that our Lord and Savior will richly bless our schools, community, and nation. All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. I'm Alan Hanley, got my buddy Daniel Munzo. Panthers leading 42 to 30. First half scores. Talbert with five points, Magby with three, Gein with 11, Nana with four, Cupcake with six, Dorsey with 13 points in the first half. Turner County, you got Fowler with six, Martin with three, Edwards with nine, Lawson with 10, Wilson with two. Those are your top scores for both teams. Panthers outscored Turner 24 to 13 in the first and 18 to 17 in the second. Turner picked it up a little bit. Now both coaches had a chance to coach him up. Let's see what happens. Turner with the ball. They got it to Fowler. Turn around, jump shot. Got it to go. Good shot. 42-32, back to a 10-point lead. That's as close as it's been in a long time. Dean over the cupcake. Dorsey with the ball. Drives in the paint, trying to get it to go. Can't. A rebound in there by Fowler. Here comes Turner. Good pass. Oh, had her wide open under the gold. She couldn't hold on. Man, that was going to be an easy layup for Turner. They're trying to get it to Williams. Cupcake has it. She'll bring it down across the court. Over to Asia. Asia, 20-footer off the rim. Can't get it to go. Turner with the rebound. Turns it over. Let's see. Panthers have it, I think. They do. Turner lost it out of bounds. Asia got it to Dorsey. Dorsey, one move to the basket off the backboard. It won't go. Got her own rebound. This time it'll go. 15 points tonight for Dorsey. Clinton said Turner better not have their fans and cheerleaders on the baseline. That is a new GHSA rule. Nobody can, so. And everybody's sitting where they should be tonight, so far anyway. Talbert dribbling around. We're going to have a foul. And that's going to be on Williams. That'll be her first. Carter says, okay, girls, let's get it. Let's go. Let's go, Dean. Your uncle wants 16 points tonight. Well, Dean doesn't need but five more. I think she's going to get that. All right, here comes Turner now. They got it over to number 12, Wilson. She'll lose it out of bounds, and here come the Panthers. Cupcake bringing it down the court. Asia with the ball. Asia, Dean will clean it up, and there's another basket by Dean. 13 points tonight for Dean. 46-32. Panthers trying to get up a big lead. Dorsey with the block. Oh, they're going to call a foul. And that'll be on Dorsey, and that'll be her second. Free throw on the way 
Trying to see who's taking the shot. First one up and in, good shot. I think that is Harding. Second one in, can't get it to go. That was Harding. Dean down, couldn't get the roll. Turner with the rebound, here they come. Lawson with the ball, lays it up, can't get it to go. Talbert with the rebound, she lost it. Cupcake saved it, no, and she lost it out of bounds. Both teams playing hot potato, don't want the ball. Alice Taylor says, let's go Panthers. Turner has it. Oh, there's another turnover. Dean has it. She stole it. She's going to take it to the basket. Up and in. 15 points. And Dean got a, chan a chance to make it a three-point play here. Forty-eight, thirty-three, five, forty-three to play in the third. Shot on the way off the side of the rim. Here comes Turner now. They need a basket, and I mean a basket. Good pass, ball movement. Can't get it to go. Turner with the rebound. Nani reached in there and tried to grab it. Here come the Panthers now. Talbert all the way throws it up, knocked out of bounds. Turner has it. Wilson coming in for the Panthers. Here comes Turner now. They drive to the right. Oh, we're gonna have a foul on Wilson. That'll be her second. First shot on the way, and it won't go. Asia will check, it, check out and take a break now. Magby in the game. Second shot on the way. Off the back of the rim, Dorsey with the rebound. Magby coming now. They give it up to Nana. Nana got it to Dorsey. Dorsey from the free throw line. It's wide. Magby trying to save it, but it'll go out of bounds. Here comes Turner now. Lawson with the ball. Should give it up to Edwards. Long three in and out. It wouldn't go. Wilson slapped it back. Turner with another shot. That was Lawson again. Went out of bounds. Turner still has it. We're over 1,200 people watching now here on Creek Box. We appreciate everybody tuning in. Turner driving, throws it up too hard. We got a foul. That'll be on Magby. That'll be her third. Coach Chase will hurry up and get Stevens in the game, and Magby will have to come back and sit down. First shot up, and she'll miss it. Second free throw on the way. Got that one, good shot. Here come uh, the Panthers now. That was Edwards at the free throw line. Got it to Wilson, back door up and in. Good shot by Wilson. Good pass by Dorsey. 50 to 34 now, Panthers lead.
Here come the Panthers. Nana with the ball. She'll lose it out of bounds. Turner slapped it. The Panthers will keep possession. Dean back in the game. Dean with 15 points tonight for the Panthers here in the third. Talbert got it into Dean. Over to Nana. Nana driving in, can't get it to go. Here come Turner. Lost him with the ball. All the way, lays it up, can't get it. Wilson with a block from behind on Edwards, and here come the Panthers. Talbert back to Wilson from the free throw line, got it. Back to back baskets by Wilson. 52-34 now, Panthers out in front. There's a foul, Edwards, no, no foul. Harding had it, long shot. Fowler will save it, she'll put it up, can't get it to go. Another offensive rebound, they can't get it to go. And another offensive rebound. Good move there by Edwards, she finally will get it to go. 52-36. Stevens with the ball now. Over to Nana. Nana back to Wilson. Wilson dribbles. She could. She'll miss. Fowler with the rebound. Here she comes. She'll pull up at the free throw line. It's short. Fowler's limping. We got a time, I think. Lawson's down. Looked like she twisted her ankle. We'll take a break and we'll be back in just a second. At Douglas Metal and Steel Manufacturing, we only use top quality steel and roofing. And with our on-staff custom designer, we can customize your building to best suit your needs. From large commercial, agriculture, or just a place to store your stuff. And it comes with a written 40-year warranty that we'll put in your hand. It's not just quality we stand behind, but we stand on. Call today for a free quote. Douglas Metal and Steel Manufacturing. We are steel number one. Lutz, Brown, Piegler, and Manley Insurance Agency is locally owned and has been a part of the Homerville, Clinch County community for many years. We make it a priority to know our clients on a personal basis and take pride in customizing insurance coverage for the particular needs of each customer. We offer all lines of insurance including auto, home, business, life insurance, annuities, and bonds. Lutz, Brown, Piegler, and Manley Insurance Agency, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. Go! All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box. We're live here in Ashburn, Georgia. Panthers leading 52 to 36. Turner will throw it away. Panthers will take over again. Nana will bring it in for the Panthers. She'll get it to Stevens, and here come the Panthers. Morris with the ball, good pass to Dean down low, and there it is, another basket. 17 points for Dean tonight. Turner trying to get down inside, Panthers playing some great defense, won't let them. Turner driving, there's a turnover, Nana has it. She's gonna take it all the way, blocked out of bounds. Panthers keep possession. Dorsey back in the game, Talbert will take a break. Morris will bring it in for the Panthers. They get it to Dorsey at the free throw line. Back to Morris, long three, short. Dean has it, jump ball. Panthers will keep it, they've got the possession. Morris bringing it in for the Panthers. You fine, darling. Dean with the ball. Nana with it now, Nana almost lost it. Dorsey with the ball, good job. They got it tied up, they're gonna call it a jump ball. (laughs) 
Here comes Turner. Lawson with the ball. Got it back over to Martin. Travel, that's another turnover. Panthers take over. Asia in the game now. Dean will take a break. Stevens with the ball. She'll get it to Morris. Morris off the backboard, can't get it to go. Asia with the rebound. She'll put it up. Dorsey has it. Got it back to Talbert. Up and in. 56-36, back to a 20-point lead for the Panthers. Good save by Turner. Long three off the rim. Rebound, number four, that's Edwards. Twenty-three, they're gonna call that on Dorsey. That'll be her third. 104 to play in the third. Turner trying to get it in. They do. Got it to Williams. Williams will put it up. No good. Asia with the rebound. Here come the Panthers. Marsh with the ball. Got it to Dean. Dean or Dorsey. Dorsey was driving to the basket. They knocked it out from behind. She was fixing to lay it up for another basket. Dorsey with 15 points tonight. Martin finally gets it across. Back over to Edwards. Edwards will drive in, can't get it to go. Number 11 has it. She'll put it up. That's Collins. No good. Now here come the Panthers. 25 seconds. Oh, we're going to have a block on Nana. That'll be Nana's first. Turner has the ball. 22 seconds to play here in the third. Sanders in the game now for Turner, number 10. Collins are going to bring it in. Now, now I'll take a break now for the Panthers. All right, here comes Turner now. Clock is running. There's another turnover. Talbert has it. Oh, and she palmed it over. She got tripped up. So the Panthers give it right back. That's Edwards. Oh, Cupcake almost with the steal. Turner drives in, and they'll get it this time. And that's going to do it for three quarters. It's Panthers 56, Turner County Titans 38. We'll be back in 60 seconds. Clinch Memorial Family Practice is growing to better meet the needs of our community. Located in the heart of Homerville, we're convenient for so many of you from Homerville to Lakeland, Statonville, and Pearson. We're a qualified team to take care of you and your family. In addition to primary care, we are a medical spa. We provide a variety of massage therapy and aesthetic services. From sick visits to deep tissue massages and facials, Clinch Family Practice is here to serve you. We look forward to seeing you. Located in Homerville, Georgia, the Avery House offers the finest selection of bespoke home decor, thoughtfully curated gifts, fresh and permanent florals, jewelry, and bridal registries. Open Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. with limited shopping hours on Wednesday and Saturday from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. The Averett House is the ultimate shopping destination with gifts for him and her. 
All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. We're in the fourth quarter now. Panthers leading 56 to 38. Panthers with the ball. Dean with the shot. She'll draw a foul. They're going to put that on number three, Martin. That'll be her second. Flip says, let's go, Talbert. Dean at the free throw line now. Dean with 17 points. You missed the first one. Second one on the way. Got it. Good shot by Dean. 57-38. They'll throw that one away. Out of bounds. Panthers will take over again. Coach Chase put a little pressure on them here in the fourth. Talbert will bring it in. Got it to Cupcake. Cupcake over to Asia. Asia down low to Dorsey. Over to Dean behind the free throw line. Can't get it to go. Jump ball, jump ball. Asia will reach in and tie it up now. You don't have to tell her twice. Turner has the ball. They'll get it into Edwards. Edwards all the way to the basket, comes up short. Collins put it back up, can't get it. We're going to have another jump ball. Panthers should have it now. Here comes the Panthers, Cupcake with the ball. Asia back to Cupcake. Good pass to Dorsey down low and got it. 59-38. Turner trying to get to half court. They do. Long three. Got it. Good shot by Sanders with the basket. Stevens over to Asia. To Dean in the paint. She'll throw it up. Draws a foul. That's going to be on 11 Collins. That's her first. Dean at the free throw line. First one on the way. In and out. Number 12 in for the Panthers. That's Williams. Or excuse me. For Turner, that is Wilson, not Williams. Dean with another pretty shot. 60 to 41 now. Edwards trying to get it over. Good steal by Cupcake. Lays it up and in. Cupcake's best game of the seasons tonight. 62-41. Edwards with the ball, drives in, lays it up and in. Good shot by Edwards. Clock is running, six minutes, 10 seconds. Asia with the ball, back out to Cupcake, and she traveled. Turner's got to start putting something together now. Edwards with the ball. She'll lose it. Dorsey will tip it to Cupcake, and Cupcake lost it. Here comes Turner now. Good pass underneath to number 20. Harding, and she'll put it in. 62-45 now. Talbert over to Dorsey. Dorsey down low off the backboard. Can't get it to go. 
Here come the Panthers now, or Turner now, from one end. Good block there by Asia. Great job. Stevens in the game, along with Magby. Long three off the rim. Dorsey with the rebound. Panthers almost lost it. Good job by Magby. Magby got it underneath again. Can't get it. Stevens will put it up. Can't get it. Finally, Turner County will come down with it. That's Wilson for Turner. Dorsey saves it. Oh, knocked down, and they're going to call a foul on 12. Wilson, that'll be her fourth. Panthers have it. Talbert with the ball. Good pass to Dorsey in the paint. She'll come up short. Good job by Magby. will put it up and in. 64-45. Long three. Can't get it to go. Dorsey with another rebound. There's a steal by Turner. Lays it up and in. And that makes it 64 to 47. We got a timeout. We'll take one. We'll be back in just a second. And then along came Walker Jones. At Walker Jones, new 2024 Chevy trucks are arriving daily. And the 23s must, must go. go. Like this beautiful iridescent white pearl tri-co Chevy Silverado 1500 High Country. Price to move. And Walker Jones is the home of the lifetime warranty at no extra cost to you. Chevy, Chevy find new roads. Walker Jones Chevrolet. Memorial Drive in Waycross. And online at walkerjoneschevy.com. Get the best deal from Walker Jones. Don't forget your little ones this holiday season at our newest store, The Little Averett, offering a large selection of children's clothing, toys, paper goods, and baby registries with brands such as Proper Peony, Beaufort Bonnet, Feltman Brothers, Noodle and Boo, and Mary Mary. Mary Averett and The Little Averett are open Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. with limited shopping hours. Hi, right, here we are. In the fourth quarter, 419 to play. Panthers lead 64-47. Magby will bring it in. Got it to Asia. Asia's going to slow it down back to Magby. Magby play some good basketball tonight. Over to Talbert. Asia with the ball now. Dorsey to the basket. Got it. Dorsey putting on a clinic tonight, playing good. 18 points tonight for Dorsey. There's a good shot by Turner. That was number four. That's Edwards right back down the court. Stevens with the ball. Got it to Dorsey. Dorsey thought about it. She will now. Look, 12-footer. Got it. Good job by Dorsey. 68-49. Turner driving, good block there by Dorsey. She'll take it. Panthers coming. Asia, she'll hand it off to Talbert. Talbert back to Asia. Good job by Asia to keep the ball back door. Stevens up and in. Good ball movement by the Panthers. 70 to 49 now. Future says, let's go, number four, Dean. Dorsey didn't block it, but made her miss. You can believe that. Here comes Talbert. Out to Magby. Magby lays it up. She'll draw a foul. That's on number 10. That's Sanders. That'll be her first.
We're up above 1,500 people watching tonight. We appreciate everybody tuning in here live on Creek Box. Remind everybody, next week, me and Daniel's going to try to bring you a couple of basketball games from the Rec Park. Got to get with my buddy A.C. Cooper, the Homerville Clinch County Recreation Director. So y'all just stay updated. On Facebook, we'll let you know when we got it. Dean with the rebound. She'll throw it up. Can't get it to go. Here come Turner. 2.40 to play in the game. Get it down low to 20. She lays it up and in. Good job there by Harding with the basket. Talbert back down the court. Over to Dorsey. Dorsey with a three. Boom! Got it! Good shot, Dorsey on fire tonight here in the second half in the fourth quarter. 73-51. Dorsey will tip it and Turner will lose it out of bounds. Dorsey playing some basketball over here in Turner this evening. Magby, good pass, got it to Dorsey. Dorsey moves back to the basket, up and in. Oh, no, they didn't call it. They called it on Dorsey. Man, what a move. I don't know how in the world they called a foul on. That's foul number four. 23 points tonight for Dorsey. 150 to play, 73-51. Panthers have played some defense tonight. There's another tip and steal by Dorsey Turner. Get it. Throws it up. Got it in. Good job there by number 20 for Turner. That's Harding. Morris with the ball. Got it to Magby. Magby will dribble through all the way to the basket. Lays it up. Can't get it to go. Turner has it now. Back down the court. Good block there by Talbert. She has it all the way from one end to the other. Can't get it to go, but it'll draw a foul. I think that's on number five. Let's see. It is number five. That's Lawson. That'll be her second. Calhoun says, let's go, Asia. Richard Sell says the Panthers are balling, brother. They are tonight. They must have slept like Daniel on the way over here. They full of energy. I've been yawning. Coach Chase getting some of the younger kids in. Talbert at the free throw line. She'll miss it. Here comes Turner from one end to the other. Lays it up. She can't get it to go. That'll be a foul on Morris. That'll be her first. That'll put Williams at the free throw line for Turner. 73-53. I don't know that I've ever seen a team come over and beat Turner's girls by 20 at home. Nana back in the game now. Second shot on the way for Williams. Can't get it to go. Knocked it around. There with number 11. Collins with the rebound. Mars. Bringing it down for the Panthers. Dorsey has it. Nana with the ball, driving to the basket. Can't get it to go. Rebound in there. Number 14, that's Colsey, I think. Yes. Mars with a three, off the rim. Can't get it to go. Williams slaps it to Dorsey. Dorsey puts it up, can't get it. Williams with the rebound, back out to Mars. Mars with another three and hits the back of the rim and goes out. 73, 53, 35 seconds. Y'all don't go nowhere because the boys will come on next. Number 10 with a long three, wraps around the rim. Wilson will tip it to Dorsey. 
Here comes Causey with the ball. Causey back to Morris. 15 seconds. Morris back to Causey. She got it. She'll throw it up. Can't get it. Wilson with the rebound. will put it up. She'll miss it. Here comes Turner now. Dorsey will steal it. Lost it out of bounds with five seconds to play. The Panthers, the Lady Panthers will stay undefeated and in first place in region play. This is a big win. Next week, the Panthers go to Statenville Friday and then have to go to L.A. Saturday, Lanier County. That's going to be a good game. We'll have Coach Chase at halftime of the boys game. Lady Panthers, 73. Turner County, 53. We're going to take a break, and we'll be back here in about 15 minutes. Y'all don't go nowhere. And then a Lonky Walker Jones. At Walker Jones, new 2024 Chevy truck are arriving daily. And the 23s must go. Like this beautiful iridescent white pearl trico Chevy Silverado 1500 High Country. Price to move. At Walker Jones is the home of a lifetime warranty at no extra cost to you. Chevy, Chevy find new roads. Walker Jones Chevrolet. Memorial Drive in Waycross. And online at walkerjoneschevy.com. Get the best deal from Walker. Don't forget your little ones this holiday season at our newest store, The Little Averett, offering a large selection of children's clothing, toys, paper goods, and baby registries with brands such as Proper Peony, Beaufort Bonnet, Feltman Brothers, Noodle and Boo, and Mary Mary. Mary Averett and The Little Averett are open Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. with limited shopping hours Wednesday and Saturday from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Come join us for the merriest shopping experience in the South. Crafted with you in mind, our homes are a blend of style and warmth, turning dreams into reality. Whether you're seeking mobile, modular, or manufactured homes, Clayton Homes of Waycross has the perfect fit for you. Join the thousands who've chosen comfort, chosen quality, chosen Clayton Homes. Call today to speak with one of our experienced home consultants, 912-284-1728. We also offer land home packages, Clayton Homes of Waycross. Be merry this holiday season at the Mary Averett, located in the heart of downtown Homerville, Georgia, the largest Christmas decor and holiday showroom south of Atlanta. Come experience the magic of the holiday season with brands such as Christopher Radko, Mark Roberts, and Glitterville, with an extensive selection of tree trimmings, tabletop decor, and holiday-themed gifts. The Mary Averett has everything you need to make every day a holiday. At Richards in Homerville, Georgia, you'll find the best meats and seafood anywhere around. For all your holiday needs, parties, and special events, we provide catering that will make the occasion one your guests will never forget. Whether it's a wedding, company party, political event, or convention from Savannah to Atlanta and parts beyond, call Gregory to schedule Richards Catering Service or to purchase their famous barbecue sauce today. 912 487-5822. Enjoy the Pizza Inn all-day buffet with more than 40 items featuring salads, pasta, desserts, and pizzas located at 501 South City Boulevard in Waycross. Whether you want to dine in or take out, the Pizza Inn in Waycross is the place to go for wonderful pizza and salad bar. Call 912-809-2411 for takeout orders or drop by for a grand dining experience. The Pizza Inn, Waycross, Georgia. Need a break? Need some quality family time? Get over to Camping World of Valosta right now. Camping World of Valosta can put you in an RV for as little as $5 per day. 
Make your dreams of camping with your family or a road trip across the USA reality. Experience the freedom that comes with the purchase of an RV from Camping World of Alaska. Whether it is a purchase of an RV, maintenance, service, or camping supplies, Camping World of Alaska can meet all of your RV needs. So don't put your dreams off another day. As part of our commitment to convenient health care and the highest quality in pharmacy services, Clinch Memorial Pharmacy offers three convenient ways for you to get your prescriptions. We offer an easy walk-in location near the ER entrance. Our pharmacist is on site, ready to help if you have any questions. With our curbside pickup options, we will bring the prescriptions to your car. Just call ahead. We also offer a delivery service for prescriptions for patients in Clinch County. Make the change today. Call 912 470-2359 to learn more. Big Daddy's Bar & Grill, located at 31 East Dame Avenue, Homerville, has the best food and atmosphere anywhere around. Big Daddy's Bar & Grill has a great lunch and dinner menu with a wide variety of your favorite food including the perfectly grilled steak, wraps, sandwiches, chicken and salads. Big Daddy's in Homerville also has your favorite drink to go with your meal. Drop by Big Daddy's in Homerville, you won't be disappointed. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill on 84 in Homerville for the best food and drinks around. At Burt CPAs, helping small businesses with their accounting needs is our business. We have offices in Homerville, Waycross, Alma, and Baxley. Burt's professionals are ready to serve you no matter your location. We are your team for accounting, bookkeeping, tax, and financial advice. In Homerville, call firm partner Adam Toll. Napa Auto Parts 255 South Church Street, Homerville, Georgia is your one stop for all auto, truck parts, tools, equipment, and accessories. Napa Auto Parts has been a name you can trust in Homerville for many years. If Napa does not have the item you need in stock, the friendly, knowledgeable, and efficient personnel at Napa Auto Parts will have it for you the next day. Open at 7 a.m. Monday through Friday and 8 a.m. on Saturday, Napa Auto Parts in Homerville is a name you can trust. Napa Auto Parts in Homerville. From our swing bed service to our primary care practice, and now our new retail pharmacy, Clinch Memorial Hospital is equipped to provide our community the best care right here at home. Dr. Ankor is Clinch Memorial's physician and offers quality care at Clinch Family Practice, where our community can also enjoy spa services. At Clinch Memorial Pharmacy, patients can fulfill their prescriptions conveniently with our curbside pickup services. We also provide the COVID vaccine. Give us a call at 912 470-2359 to schedule yours today. This is Alan Hanley, and I want to tell you about Dre's Snack Shack. Dre specializes in chicken wings, barbecue, sausage, hot dogs, hamburgers, salads, and a variety of other mouth-watering menu items. So y'all come on down and see Dre at Dre's Snack Shack. He can handle all your catering needs also. The good thing is he stays open late at night after the game. So please come in and see Dre at Dre Snack Chat. For the best pizza and wings in town any day of the week, check out Huey's One Stop in Homerville. Drop by, fuel up, and let Mr. Nick Patel and staff serve you some mouth-watering pizza and wings that you won't soon forget. Or just take that favorite pizza and box of wings home. 
Call 912-487-2338 to order your pizza and wings every Friday night after the game. Huey's One Stop, 193 Church Street, Homerville. Homerville Jewelers in Homerville is your headquarters for bridal and baby registry. Our newly remodeled location has that special gift for the bride and groom or that perfect gift for the new baby. Homerville Jewelers has the gifts that are suited for any special occasion, whatever it might be. Homerville Jewelers can perform jewelry repairs and offers a variety of diamonds, gold, sterling silver, watches, and necklaces. No need to shop out of town. Homerville Jewelers can supply all your gift and jewelry needs. Let Kathy Townsend and staff serve you at Homerville Jewelers, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. Dairy Queen is a proud part of our local communities and is cheering our sports teams on to championship seasons. Drop by before and after the game to say hello to Mr. Ash and his entire crew and enjoy the full Dairy Queen menu including our famous grilled burgers, artisan style sandwiches, and chicken strips. Cool off with our renowned smoothies, slushies, malts, and iced coffees. Try our fabulous desserts and take an ice cream cake home for that special occasion or just to treat the family. Dine in or take out at Dairy Queen locations in Homerville, Blackshire, Folkestone, and Fernandina Beach. See you at the DQ. Lee Engineering and Construction Company in DuPont, Georgia has been a part of the community since 1935 and is proud to support Clinch County Athletics. The prayer of the entire Lee Engineering family is that our Lord and Savior will richly bless our schools, community, and nation. At Douglas Metal and Steel Manufacturing, we only use top quality steel and roofing. And with our on-staff custom designer, we can customize your building to best suit your needs. From large commercial, agriculture, or just a place to store your stuff. And it comes with a written 40-year warranty that we'll put in your hand. It's not just quality we stand behind, but we stand on. Call today for a free quote. Douglas Metal and Steel Manufacturing. We are steel number one. Lutz Brown Piegler and Manley Insurance Agency is locally owned and has been a part of the Homerville Clinch County community for many years. We make it a priority to know our clients on a personal basis and take pride in customizing insurance coverage for the particular needs of each customer. We offer all lines of insurance including auto, home, business, life insurance, annuities and bonds. Lutz Brown Piegler and Manley Insurance Agency, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. Go Panthers! Clinch Memorial Family Practice is growing to better meet the needs of our community. Located in the heart of Homerville, we're convenient for so many of you from Homerville to Lakeland, Statenville, and Pearson. We're a qualified team to take care of you and your family. In addition to primary care, we are a medical spa. We provide a variety of massage therapy and aesthetic services. From sick visits to deep tissue massages and facials, Clinch Family Practice is here to serve you.
All right, everybody, welcome out to Creek Box TV. Before the boys' game, I got Coach Chase Daniels from the girls' game. Coach Chase, I told everybody I don't remember a girls' basketball team from Homerville ever coming to tourney and winning by 20, 73 to 53. I, I mean, I don't, I don't, Turner County's been in the Sweet 16 probably for the last six, seven years in a row. Uh, we just played great tonight. We did. Well, uh, I challenged them yesterday at practice, and they responded, man. Um, I tell you, just I know you can't really compare scores, but I kind of just wanted to see where we're at. Uh, Montgomery County's 14-0, and 0, the last time I looked. Ranked number one in the state, and uh, and they beat Turner by 14. They beat uh -huh. them 52 to 38. I got you. And um, you know Wilcox, who beat us over here in the Christmas tournament, um, beat them by 10 and 25. I got you. But now when they beat them by 25, number two was out with a concussion. A Fowler. Yeah, that's yeah. That, that's her best player. Yeah, she was out with a concussion when they beat them by 25, but they beat them by 10 the other time. Well, man, Dorsey's playing some great basketball here the last two games, really. She had, she, she's turned it up. She had 25 points and 22 rebounds. I'm telling you, and Dean had 19 points. Yeah, and right she had and nine rebounds. She almost had a double-double, too. Probably would have if I, you know, I sub, sub late, get those other girls in there. That's it's always right. good to get That's them right. in. Wilson coming in off the bench, she, she had – Three or four, five points. Yep, and um, I thought Nana had a good game tonight. She did, Nana. And, uh, man, the passing. We moved the ball around, got in the back door a lot, man, off the basket. Uh, we're starting the boys' game. The Panthers are in their black uniforms, and Turner County will be in their white. But, yeah, um, I, I know we got to wrap it up right here, but I was just very – I told them in the locker room, that's the best team ball we've played. Oh, yeah. It's the best passing. It is. I bet half our buckets came off of an assist. Um, you look, and, and you don't have, you know, one or two people scoring a lot. You look right here, you know, going down the score sheet, Destiny had seven. That's Mag right. Maggie had five. Dean, 19. Cupcake with uh, a nine out with four. Cupcake with eight. That's right. Stevens Cupcake had her two. best game of the year. Yes, she did. Yes, I she mean. did. Uh, the way we moved the ball, you know, and you're always worried when you come to Turner, man. This is one of the toughest places to get a win. But looking ahead, you know, Lanier County, we got to go to Stateville Friday and then got to go to Lanier Saturday. And Lanier's playing some good basketball too now. They're much improved. Um, Turner, I think, played them last night and beat them by eight. Yeah, it, well, it was Tuesday night. It was Tuesday night. Uh, they beat them by eight. Yeah. Uh, the same night we beat Folkestone. But we're uh, – in first place now in we the are, region. We right? are with, with Lakeland left to, to finish out the first half of the region play. To and we'll cycle through yeah, and then we'll, we'll start over. Mm -hmm. Well, brother, congratulations on a big win. Biggest win of the season so far. Uh, we'll take care of business on out. It proves we can beat everybody in the region. Now you got to go back and do it again. Well, <laughs> and it's going to be tough for the second time. Oh, yeah. You know? uh, uh, but Atkinson I really – Atkinson County and Charlton County, anytime, you know uh, – I would put Axton County as the toughest region opponent we've played so far. Well, I would too. Uh, uh, you know, Charlton unfortunately lost one of their That's best, right. if That's not their right. best player with a knee injury. So, um, you know, right now I would probably say Turner and Atco, you know, but like I said, hadn't seen Lanier yet. That's right. So, That's uh, right. You know. Uh, but, but, man, uh, y'all did a great job tonight. Man, I was worried about coming over to Turner and uh, – we hadn't been in sync all year. And, man, tonight to turn it on over here in the toughest place to play and put it all together, we needed that. Now the girls have plenty of confidence moving forward. That's right. That's right. It was a confidence builder. And, um, like I said, I was very pleased, too, with um with our turnover reduction. We, I think we only had 17 turnovers. Oh, yeah, not many we at had all. eight in the first half and nine in the second. Um, and they're – with Sean told me with two minutes left in the first quarter, we had zero turnovers. That man, and just to out rebound them to death. Yeah, out rebound them to death. Dorsey, uh, and, and man, I would love one night when we get up there and you put Wilts and Dorsey and Dean down <laughs> low. I, it, 
if, if anybody takes a rebound from us, it's because they ain't trying. I can yeah. go ahead and tell you. And just imagine if we had Tom Castile. Oh, my Lord. Yeah, she's watching. <laughs> she's texting. She's oh, watching. She? Yeah, she watched. She doesn't miss the game. Well, hey, I want to tell her now, Nora's begging for her address to send her something over there. So if you're listening, Tom, we need your address. Text it in right now, darling, and I'll give it no, to don't, Coach No, don't Chester. text it in to the creek it, no, We got a private line over here. We can give her that thing. Don't worry about that. <laughs> we can give her a private number to text it in. Uh, hey. But, yeah, man, we this was – this felt good being over here. I know I've been in some – just some – very stressful tight games Boy, over they've here, been you know. some one point games and three point mm. games over here for the last three or four years i know mm -hmm. uh, i didn't realize they had a new coach over here at turner neither well uh, they got a new coach and basically a new team you know they lost to kia burgess was um outstanding player for for them last year that's playing some college ball now um over somewhere in alabama i believe and then um her cousin, Caitlin Burgess, I think, went back to Tifton. I uh, was playing for Tift County. So, you know, that's that's that was a lot yeah, of production. And then man. they had another uh, girl from last year, the tall girl. I uh, think she was number one. I think she might be – I know she's playing college. I want to say that Doreen told me she's at um, LaGrange with um, Zai. With Zai. Man, and so. they're doing good, too, both Zai and Angel. Mm -hmm. Both of them playing some good basketball. But, yeah, man, listen, Turner County girls basketball ain't going up. Oh, my Lord. You man. know, they, they're going to be solid every year. You know, they're, they they pride themselves on basketball. They do a really good job over here with their program. That's right. And, man, anybody, it looks like on any given night, if you're not playing your best, you'll get beat in the region. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, brother, you're doing a good job. We're going to watch these boys. The Panthers are leading right now 7-3, to three, and we hope they pull it out. Good shot there by Mingo. Yep, and I want to say this, too, just in case people don't know. Uh, and You know, Clinch County fan, you need to be uh, cheering for the girls this year because the number That's one right. girls seed hosts the region tournament for the girls and the boys. Doggone um, right, and we don't want to have to go nowhere. No, we don't. <laughs> and I was telling them in the locker room before the game, I said, look, this game's huge because – um, right now, you know, they're undefeated in the in the region. We're undefeated in the region. I said, so it's not just about not playing at our place. You very well may have to come here to That's play the right. region tournament, and we definitely don't want to do that. No, man, we played a tournament here and in Lakeland, and, man, it is jam-packed in here. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, they, they don't have the heat on in the lobby. You can believe that. <laughs> it is cold. <laughs> hey, yeah, there's Dorsey coming up now. Dorsey. Panthers with it. They get it to Bale. Bale's going to back it back out. It's 9 to 5. He'll kick it over. Oh, I and thought, Ar oh, I thought, I thought that RJ was a foul. got fouled there. I did too. RJ will steal it back on this end. Here come the Panthers back. There's a steal by Turner. That's Lawson with it. He'll kick it over to number two. Lays it up and in. That's Terry with the basket. Mingo with the ball. Turner turning up the heat a little bit. Raymond has it, and he'll give it back out to Bell. Over to RJ. RJ trying to get some penetration. No, and he traveled. Good defense there by number 10, Hillman. He's quick. I like the Panther uniforms they got out Chase the black one with the shorts. Yeah, they look good. They do look good. Turner coming. He's going to break it to the left. That's Bale. He'll kick it back over. Good job there. Lawson puts it up. He'll miss. Bale with the rebound. Mingo has it. Lays it up. Can't get it to go. Rebound in there by Terry. He'll give it out to Bale. Bale bringing it back down. Back door. Good pass by Bale to number 12. He'll lay it up and in. I think that's Martin. They jump right back into a man-to-man. -man. It's nine-to-nine nine now. RJ over to Miller. Miller under the basket, and he travels. This is going to be a ball game here. Nine-to-nine. Nine. Panthers coming off a big loss in Homerville, 65-60 to 60 Friday. Or last Tuesday, excuse me, against Folkestone. All right, here comes Turner, bringing it back down. That's Dawsey. 
He'll get across to half court. Looking, he'll kick it back over to Jackson. Jackson with the ball now. Back to Hillman. All the way across to Jackson. Shot clock at 10. Dossie with the ball. Shot clock at five. Number 11 has it. That's Martin. Can't get it to go. Rebound, Miller. Bell with the ball. Bell had it stole. Good job by number 11. He'll miss it. Miller with another rebound. RJ picked his dribble up. Needs help. They're going to call a jump ball. Man. Panthers have the possession. Nine to nine. That's some speed on the basketball court tonight over here in Ashford. RJ will bring it in to Bell. Back to RJ. RJ will dribble around his man. Split another one all the way. He'll lose it. He got it back. Shot it off the backboard. Won't go. We got a foul on number four. That's Jackson. That'll be his first. That'll put RJ at the free throw line. Turner County subbing, just they keep subbing. RJ's first shot, up and in, good job. 11 in the game, Martin back in the game now for Turner. RJ back in it. Yeah, I know it. All right, here we go. Number four, got it to five. Off the backboard, up and in by Turner. That's Dulcie with the basket. 11-11 now. Bell has it right back to RJ. Here come the Panthers. 135 to play in the first. Raymond with the ball. Back to Bryant. Bryant trying to drive in, lays it off the backboard, up and in. Good shot by Bryant. 13 to 11, Panthers on top. Here comes Jackson. He'll give it back up to Martin. They're going to set up a different play now. Over to Ville. Ville dribbling around. He'll kick it over to five. That's Dulcie. Dulcie drives to the basket, can't get it to go. We got a foul. Let's see who this one's on. We appreciate it, Coach Chase. Good luck, man. Girls played great. All right, here we go. Lawson checking back in. Thirteen to eleven, Panthers on top. Second shot on the way off the backboard. Got it. Thirteen to twelve. Here come the Panthers. Bryant with the ball. He lost it. We're going to have a foul on zero. That's Lawson. I think that's his first. Nessie says, I see you, Kyra. Lacey, way to go, Lady Panthers. We got 2,000 people watching tonight here on Creek Box. We appreciate everybody tuning in. 13 to 12. This is going to be a game. RJ with the ball. He'll give it up to Bryant. Panthers in their black uniforms. Almost lost it. RJ saves it. Back over to Bryant. And Turner's just so quick. Good shot over there by Bryant. And one. On number five, that's Dulcie. Bryant. Got a chance to make it a three-point play here. Panthers lead now 15 to 12. First shot, got it. 
So he did complete the three-point play. Here comes Turner now, 16 to 12, 35 seconds to play in the first. Over to number 11, that's Martin. Another turnover, good job. Got it out, there's the man, Bell drives it up, can't get it to go. Boy, he was knocked into the crowd. Getting up slow. Got it to go, that's gonna be a foul. On 23, Raymond. 18 seconds to play. That was a foul away from the shot. Good job, Bell stole it, he'll throw it all the way down. Lays it up and in, good job by RJ. 18 to 12, six, five, four, three, two, long three, can't get it to go and that's it. So after one quarter of play, Clinch County 18, Turner County 12, we'll be back in 60 seconds. Located in Homerville, Georgia, the Avery House offers the finest selection of bespoke home decor, thoughtfully curated gifts, fresh and permanent florals, jewelry, and bridal registries. Open Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. with limited shopping hours on Wednesday and Saturday from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. The Avery House is the ultimate shopping destination with gifts for him and her. And then a Lonky Walker Jones. At Walker Jones, new 2024 Chevy trucks are arriving daily. And the 23s must go. Like this beautiful iridescent white pearl tri-coat Chevy Silverado 1500 High Country. Price to move. At Walker Jones is the home of the lifetime warranty at no extra cost to you. Chevy, find new roads. Walker Jones Chevrolet. Memorial Drive in Waycross. And online at walkerjoneschevy.com. Get the best deal from Walker Jones. All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. I'm Alan Hanley, got my bad buddy, Daniel Munoz, up there working the camera. 18 to 12, Panthers on top. Turner with the ball. Bell will bring it in. He'll give it up to Hillman. Hillman looking around, they'll get it back to Vail. Vail looking somewhere to drive, good job. He'll give it up to Lawson, Lawson driving in. Bryant knocks it out of bounds, and it went off. Lawson, so the Panthers have it. Turner keeping the pressure on. They get it to Bryant. Brian across half court, dribbling around. Got it over to RJ. Back to Bryant. Bryant pulls up just inside the three. Can't get it to go. Rebound in there, number five, Dulcie for Turner. He'll bring it down. Drives to the basket. He traveled. Jordan. Says Janelle Wilson, that's my son, that's my sister, all right. Let's go, Bell. From Alice Taylor. Here comes Bell down the court. He'll fake the pass, lays it up, couldn't get it to go, got his rebound. Back out to RJ. Over to Mingo. Mingo trying to get it into Miller. Miller wraps it up. Man, there's a collision. Jump ball. I think Turner has the possession. Let's see. No, Panthers will keep it. 18 to 12, 704 to play in the first half. Bell with the ball. Miller with it. Miller makes a move to the backboard. Got it. Good job by Miller. 20 to 12 now. Turner needing a basket. Bell with the ball. 
Oh, they'll kick it out. Oh, we got a foul. No, a jump ball. Well, they'll call a jump ball. Turner will have the possession. Hey, letting them play tonight is right, Richard. Long three off the back of the rim. Rebound Miller. Bryant has the ball now for Clinch. Here come the Panthers. He'll pull up at the free throw line off the rim. Can't get it. Miller with the rebound. He tries to put it up. Surrounded by Titans. Got it off somehow. There's RJ off the rim, and we got a foul. A foul on number one. RJ was the one shooting the ball, but I guess he pushed off what they're saying. So. All right, here comes Turner. They moving it around. Hillman with the ball. Back to Dulcie. Trying to get it down to Hillman low. Good job by RJ. Bell with the ball now. Back over to Bryant. Back to Bell. Bell looking for a gap. He'll kick it out to RJ. Oh, in and out. We got a foul this time. They called it on RJ again. Man, Coach Terrence is a little aggravated with that one. That's two fouls on RJ. Here come the Titans. Hillman bringing it down. Panthers on an eight to nothing run here. Hillman with the ball. Good defense by the Panthers. Hillman driving in, he'll kick it out to Val. Trying to get it down low, Bryant with the steal. Here come the Panthers now. Good crossover move by Bryant. Got it to Posley, back out to Bell. Bell setting it up. He'll pull up just outside the free throw line. He'll miss it off the back of the rim. Here come the Titans. Martin, he'll pull up at the free throw line. Can't get it. Miller had it, and he'll lose it. Bow with a three off the rim. Can't get it. Another offensive rebound. Good pass there by number 10. Hillman kicked it out. And Martin made the basket. We got a 30-second timeout. I got to give a shout-out to our sponsors. We have Douglas Metal, Richard's Meat and Seafood and Famous Barbecue, the Averett House, the Little Averett, and the Mary Averett. Huey's One Stop. Lutz Brown insurance. More farms right there in Maynard, Georgia. Walker Jones of Waycross. Burt, CPA, Napa Auto, a Homerville. Big Daddy's on Highway 84. They're probably watching the game up there right now. Savage Turner Law Firm. Camping World of Alasta. Clinch Memorial Family Practice. Clinch Memorial Pharmacy. Big K and Lee Engineering in DuPont. Pizza Inn and Waycross. Clayton Homes of Waycross. Clinch Memorial Hospital Community Paramedicine Program. Homerville, Fargo, Feed and Seed, Dre Snack Shack, Homerville Jewelers, and Clinch Memorial Hospital. We appreciate all of them. We got some new sponsors coming on here shortly. Boom! Good shot by Mingo with a three. 23 to 14 now. Powell with the ball for Turner. He'll kick it over to Martin. Martin and back over to Dalsey. Hillman with the ball now. Trying to get it low. Good job. Number five lays it up. Can't get it. Rebound in there by Mingo. He'll give it to Bell. Bell from one end to the other. They grabbed it. No foul. A long pass back down to number two. He drives in reverse. Lays up. Has it. He'll go against the wall. No foul. They jump right back in a little press. Bryant dribbles through it. 
There's a turnover, number one, had it. Foul did, he lost it. Dawsey with the ball. 23-16, 3.20 to play in the first half. Dawsey, long three, can't get it to go. Bryant had it. Lost it out of bounds. Turner will keep the possession. Lawson back in the game. Dawsey will take a break for Turner. Oh, bringing it in for Turner, trying to get it. Number two has it. Long three, got it! Hillman with a three. 23-19, here comes Turner back. Bell with the ball. Trying to get it down low. Got it this time. Burns, got it! Good shot by Burns. 25-19, here comes Turner back down the court. Another three. Martin can't get it to go. Rebound, good job by Lawson. He'll put it up and in. 25-21 now. Posley bringing it down for the Panthers. Fighting for it, Turner has it. Panthers will keep it, I think they called Trevor. Nope, they called a timeout. Good heads up play by Turner. So we'll take a break and we'll be back in just a second. At Richards in Homerville, Georgia, you'll find the best meats and seafood anywhere around. For all your holiday needs, parties and special events, we provide catering that will make the occasion one your guests will never forget. Whether it's a wedding, company party, political event, or convention from Savannah to Atlanta and parts beyond, call Gregory to schedule Richard's Catering Service or to purchase their famous barbecue sauce today. 912-487-5822. All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. We're live here in Ashburn, Georgia, the home of the Titans. 25-21, Panthers on top. Here comes Turner now. Jackson bringing it down. He'll kick it out to Hillman. Oh, and they said he traveled. Angie says, let's go Panthers from Jonathan and Angela Talbert from Cut and Loop Road. We appreciate y'all tuning in. Jonas Campbell. I like those black jerseys with where you get them from, Coach George. They sharp. I agree with you, Jonas. Oh, Raymond got it. Saved it somehow trying to drive in. What do we got here? Got a foul on 11. That is Martin. All right, Panthers have it. Bryant's going to bring it in to Bell. Back to Bryant. Bell has it now. Bell, good pass to Burns, and that's going to be a foul. They're going to call it on number one. That's foul. That'll be its first. That'll put Burns at the free throw line. Miss Johnson says, let's go, fellas. I've been waiting on you, Miss Johnson. I knew you was watching, darling. First free throw on the way. Burns will miss it off the back of the rim. Second shot on the way. Got it. Good job by Burns. Three points tonight for Burns. 26-21, Panthers on top. Here come the Titans. Looking almost foul, almost shot the long one. He'll drive in, throws it up. Good defense. Oh, they're going to call a foul. Man. Bell made him adjust his shot because you're not going to shoot over Bell. Nobody can. And they're going to call a foul on Bell. 
That's his first. 26-21, 144 to play in the first half. Battle's first shot on the way, can't get it. Second free throw on the way. Can't get that one either. Raymond fighting for it. He got it. Oh, they said he traveled. I think Coach George liked that one. Turner will keep the possession now. All right, here comes Turner. Jackson with the ball. Oh, three-point shot, can't get it to go. Bell with the rebound, he'll give it to Bryant. Pulled up, can't get it to go. Rebound, Raymond, back to Bryant. Well, they got Bryant trapped. Raymond has it, they said he traveled. Coach Terrence will give that laser stare. 26-21, Panthers lead by five. Hillman will check back in the game. Jackson will take a break for Turner. All right, here come the Titans. Foul with the ball. Oh, got it, a three-point shot and a foul on Posley. Man, he made the shot. Four point play here. Hillman's second three. 26 24, Panthers lead. 59 seconds to play. Free throw on the way, got it. Four point play, the first one I've seen this year. 26-25, a one point game. Bryant, good pass back door, got it. Good job by Burns. 28-25, Panthers lead. 45 seconds, clock running here in the first half. Martin looking, he'll pull up at the free throw line, can't get it, a rebound, another offensive rebound. Bell got a piece of that one. Oh, and they're gonna call that one on Bell. Coach George puts his hands on his hip, just shakes his head. You gotta get Bell at now, that's two fouls. Man, he got up high and fell into him with his body. Really, he... He fell beside him and the wind shifted his body. It's what it looked like. <laughs> anyway, they called it on Bell. He got a piece of the ball. Nett says, hello, Creek Box. Tune in late. Did the girls win? They did, darling. They won by 20, 73-53. Hillman back at the three free throw line, shooting three of them. He can tie this thing up. He's already got a four-point play and a three-point play. Got that one. Coach Terrence subbing in some people. You got Mingo coming in and Miller coming in. Second free throw on the way for Hillman. In and out, well it wasn't a three point play apparently. All right, here comes Bryant. He's trapped up, he got it out to Mingo. Over to Posley, back to Raymond, back to Posley. Mingo got it to Miller. 
Bryant with the ball. 12 seconds, clock running, 10 seconds. The shot clock is off, six seconds, five, three, long three-pointer, can't get it. Raymond tried to tip it in, almost got it a second time. What a game we got, folks. 28-26, Panthers lead at half. We'll be back in 10 minutes. Enjoy the Pizza Inn all-day buffet with more than 40 items featuring salads, pasta, desserts, and pizzas located at 501 South City Boulevard in Waycross. Whether you want to dine in or take out, the Pizza Inn in Waycross is the place to go for wonderful pizza and salad bar. Call 912-809-2411 for takeout orders or drop by for a grand dining experience. The Pizza Inn, Waycross, Georgia. Need a break? Need some quality family time? Get over to Camping World of Valosta right now. Camping World of Valosta can put you in an RV for as little as $5 per day. Make your dreams of camping with your family or a road trip across the USA reality. Experience the freedom that comes with the purchase of an RV from Camping World of Valosta. Whether it is a purchase of an RV, maintenance, service, or camping supplies, Camping World of Valosta can meet all of your RV needs. So don't put your dreams off another day. Our commitment to convenient health care and the highest quality in pharmacy services, Clinch Memorial Pharmacy offers three convenient ways for you to get your prescriptions. We offer an easy walk-in location near the ER entrance. Our pharmacist is on site, ready to help if you have any questions. With our curbside pickup options, we will bring the prescriptions to your car. Just call ahead. We also offer a delivery service for prescriptions for patients in Clinch County. Make the change today. Call 912 Four seven zero two three five nine to learn more. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill, located at 31 East Dame Avenue, Homerville, has the best food and atmosphere anywhere around. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill has a great lunch and dinner menu with a wide variety of your favorite food, including the perfectly grilled steak, wraps, sandwiches, chicken, and salads. Big Daddy's in Homerville also has your favorite drink to go with your meal. Drop by Big Daddy's in Homerville, you won't be disappointed. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill on 84 in Homerville for the best food and drinks around. At Burt CPAs, helping small businesses with their accounting needs is our business. We have offices in Homerville, Waycross, Alma, and Baxley. Burt's professionals are ready to serve you no matter your location. We are your team for accounting, bookkeeping, tax, and financial advice. In Homerville, call firm partner. Napa Auto Parts 255 South Church Street, Homerville, Georgia, is your one stop for all.
right, everybody, we're back. I had the wrong headset on. I was up here talking to Lexi. He's at the game tonight. And we got a great one. Panthers leading 28-26. Bell driving in, trying to get it to go. Knocked out of bounds. Panthers will keep it. RJ with a three, can't get it to go. Rebound in there, number five. That is Dossie. Got it to number two. Bale slapped at it. They're going to call a foul. Oh, let's see who it's on. It is. It's on RJ. That's his third foul. Man. Bale has two, RJ three. Coach Terrence finna have to sit RJ down for a little bit. Mingo look like looks like he's getting ready to go in. What about it? Do what, darling? Huh? Hey, shout out to Coupa. A shout out to Coupa. <laughs> hey, right. Well, I just did, darling. <laughs> we just give Coupa a shout out. Terry at the free throw line for Turner. Second one on the way, got it. 28-27, a one point game now. Here comes Bell. He'll give it down, good job to Miller. Miller kicked it to Raymond. Raymond had nowhere to go. They got him wrapped up, a jump ball. Turner with the possession. Here comes Turner. They can take their first lead of the night right here. We have got right at 2,000 people watching right now on Creek Box. We appreciate everybody tuning in. And there's a travel. Turner will turn it back over. Daylin Edmonds says, let's go, Panthers. Anthony's land says, hi. Alan Clanton said, blowing the whistle, mighty late. Carolyn Jones says, let's go, CCHS. Foul on number two. That's Terry. That'll be his second. Bail at the free throw line. Shakia Robinson says, let's go, Panthers from Little Russell. He's going to be a ball player. Won't be long. We'll see him out here playing on Fridays and Saturdays and Tuesday. There's a good job by Raymond putting it back up and in. 32-27 now. Panthers trying to pull away a little bit. Long three by Val. Overshot it. Raymond with the rebound. He'll give it to Bell. Here come the Panthers. Good pass by Bell. Domingo got it. Thirty-four twenty-seven. Lawson with the ball. Dow has it now. I didn't get them all in the first. Good job by Bryant. Got it. Oh, and lost it going to the basket. Hillman will scoop it up. Here come Turner. There's another steal by Raymond. Here come the Panthers. He'll give it up to Bale. Bale passing it over to Mingo. Got him up. Got it. Good shot by Mingo. Turner says, I've seen enough. Let's call a timeout. We'll be back in 30 seconds.
All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. Amaron Blank said, man, it was never boring playing the Panthers in football. All right, Bobby Talbert says, uh, let's go bail. 36-27 now, Panthers on top. Here comes Turner. Dulcy, good pass down low to two. Panthers everywhere, they slapped it one time, slapped it again. Call a foul on Mingo. That'll be his first, I think. I thought it was Miller that got into him, but it was Mingo. That's going to put Terry at the free throw line. First shot on the way from Terry. Off the back of the rim. No, oh, second shot, no violation, jump ball, yep. All right, here come the Panthers, Bale with the ball, behind his back, behind his back again, good pass, back door, Raymond up and in. Good job passing the ball tonight by Bell. Finding the open man. Turner needing a basket now. They get it down low. He'll turn. We got a foul. Man on Mingo again. That's two on Mingo. RJ's on the bench with three fouls. Coach Terrence. Talking to the referee, he ain't worried about the foul now, he's worried about the next one. There's another miss by Terry. Turner struggling at the free throw line tonight. Burns in the game now. Mingo out. Posley getting ready to check in for the Panthers. Posley in. Burns out. Terry, second shot on the way. In and out, couldn't get it. Miller with the rebound. Bale, long pass to Posley. He saves it. Knocked out of bounds by Turner. Panthers will keep possession. 38-27. Panthers up by 11. Get it into Bale. Bell pulls up at the free throw line, got it. Good shot by Bell. 40-27. Bow with the ball. 4.55 to play in the third. Levin with it, that's Martin. There's a steal by Bryant, here come the Panthers. Right, all the way, lays it up, got fouled, hard foul there by on Bryant. Let's see who this one's on. On number five, that is Dulcy. That'll be his second. Did he hear me? They didn't. A shout out to Kupai. Well, I just did it again, darling. <laughs> All right, we got three players from Turner coming in now. Uh huh? Say what? Both of the calls play. Both of the what? Both of the calls he's play. All right. All right, I got you. <laughs> That's right. We got one on the girls and one on the boys. <laughs> hey. 42 to 27. Turner with the ball. Oh, good job by Bell. Knocked it away. He'll kick it back out to Mingo. Posley with it back to Mingo. Over to Bryant. 
Bell, long three, boom, got it. Good shot by Bell with a three-pointer. We got another timeout. And that'll be a 60-second timeout, so we'll take a break. We'll be back here in just a second. This is Alan Hanley, and I want to tell you about Dre's Snack Shack. Dre specializes in chicken wings, barbecue, sausage, hot dogs, hamburgers, salads, and a variety of other mouth-watering menu items. So y'all come on down and see Dre at Dre's Snack Shack. He can handle all your catering needs also. The good thing is he stays open late at night after the game. So please come in and see Dre at Dre's Snack Shack. All right, everybody, welcome back. Here on Creek Box, me and Daniel in Ashburn, Georgia. They have shut the Shawnees down. Man, they've been many a night, me and Daniel and Barry and Eat at Shawnees. That hot fudge cake, you can't get it no more. Long pass by Posley out to Bryant, lays it up and in. Good job by Bryant. 47-27, biggest lead of the night for the Panthers. Hillman with the ball. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a block by Mingo. Bell running for it. Turner has it. Hillman with the ball. He'll bring it across. He'll pull up at the free throw line. Got it. Good shot by Hillman. 47-29. Posley with the ball. Oh, he... Lost it, he got it back somehow, and he traveled. Turner has the ball now. Turner just can't buy a shot. Man, they are some quick, though. Lanier come over here Tuesday, I think, and beat Turner by six points. Long three by the Titans, rebound up and in. Good job there by Jackson. Remind everybody the Panthers go to Statenville Friday, but we'll be in LA, Lanier County next Saturday. So y'all go ahead and make your plan. Posley drives in, one-handed up by Raymond and puts it up. Cause that'll be a game in the doghouse. Turner driving, lays it up. Can't get it to go. Bell steals it, here he goes from one end to the other. Got his own rebound. 10 footer, can't get it. Raymond up high, he'll lose it. Turner with the rebound, here come the Titans. Pull up at the free throw line, can't get it to go. Rebound Turner. Oh, and do they have Mingo again? Let's see. Number 11, that's Posley. That'll be his second. Two minutes, 32 seconds to play in the third. Free throw on the way, can't get it. Miller back in the game, RJ back in the game finally. Got three fouls, Raymond. Give out, I think we got a timeout. 30-second timeout. We'll stay here. I want to remind you, the coaches interview, we done interviewed Chase. We got the Coach Terrence George will come in after the game, so y'all don't go nowhere, and we appreciate. Tom Kennedy is sponsoring the coaches interviews, and it's Tom Kennedy for mayor. We appreciate him doing that. He'll So y'all stick around and listen to Coach Terrence. We done had Coach Chase on, and uh, Tom will be doing that all the way through after the mayor's race. Try to get him to stay on through baseball. <laughs> hey. Jimmy, I don't know. This is the least amount of 
They, maybe they watching at Creek Box on Creek Box at home, brother. <laughs> it ain't packed out like it usually is. I agree with you. Number 12 at the free throw line. Shot on the way. Got it. Good shot. 49-32. Bell. Oh, he slapped it. Saved it. Good save over there by number 12. Got it. Uh, Bow, and he'll hit it. Good shot by Bow. Turner trying to get back in it. Good job by Bell. Got it, Domingo. They said he traveled. Another Panther turnover. Coach Terrence up, coaching him up. Yep, it was packed. I want to. We need to give a shout out to the middle school basketball championship. This is where it was played at. Panthers come over here in middle school and won their championship. Right here in this gym. Bow driving, can't get it to go. Rebound, Miller. Bell has it now. He's going to slow it down this time. He'll give it up to RJ. RJ back to Bell. Bell with a three pointer off the back of the rim. Miller rebound, got it to RJ. RJ back to Bell. Six footer, got it to go this time. And one. Bell with nine points here in the third quarter. 51-34. Bell with a chance to make another three-point play here. Got it. Good shot by Bell. 52-34. Here come the Titans. Jackson bringing it down. Over to King. King with a three-pointer off the backboard. RJ with the ball. Miller with the rebound and give it to RJ. Got it to Bell. Back to RJ. Over to Bryant. Bryant driving. Good pass to Miller under the goal. They tied up. Jump ball. Good job by Bryant to even see. I don't know how I even seen Miller. Good job by Turner to tie it up, though. Over 21. Over 2,100 uh, people watching Creek Box right now. Got it down, he'll lose it out of bounds. Panthers knocked it out of bounds. Titans have it. Long three, got it, good shot there by number 15, that's Tennille. 52-37. RJ back out Domingo. Miller, Bell cleans it up and puts it back in. Another basket for Bell here in the third, 54-37. Got it inside, Turner does. Let's see what the foul is here. Number 10, that'll be Miller. That's his first, I think. They're in the bonus now, I think it's. Let's see what they're doing. All right, number 12, they're in the bonus. So he's at the free throw line. My buddy Brett Blitch is watching. That is uh, <laughs> the P 
Panama City Brett. <laughs> There's another free throw by number 12, another basket. All right, here we go. Bell wide open under the basket. Got it to Miller. Miller with the basket. 15 seconds. Richard saying, come on, refs, get in the game. All, right. All the way across. <laughs> yeah, ride with Clyde. That's right. <laughs> Panthers, I don't know. That's it. A long one off the board. So that's it. After three quarters, 56 to 39. We'll be back in 60 seconds. All right, here we go. I'm taking a sip of my Coca-Cola. We're here in the fourth quarter. Panthers miss it. Out of bounds. Turner has it. Fifty-six, thirty-nine. All right, here come the Titans. They are, brother. They are sharp. Look like they come from the Lazy Daisy back in the day. I like them jerseys and the shorts. All right, Turner with the ball. Trying to get back in it. Long three off the rim, can't get it. Offensive board up. Another foul, Coach Terrence George getting Bell back in the game. 15 with the foul, that's Burns. Twelve back at the free throw line. I don't have that young man's name. Anybody knows if you'll give it to me. Pretty good ball player. 24 checking in the game now. I don't have a 24 either. Second free throw on the way, got it. 12's got five points tonight for Turner. All right, Bell bringing it down. 16 point lead for the Panthers, 56 to 40. Raymond with the ball inside, got it. Good job by Raymond. 58 to 40 now, Val with the ball. Crossover, nowhere to go. They pick him up good. Got it to 12, lays it up. Can't get it to go, but he'll draw a foul. 23, that's Raymond. That'll be his second. 12 points in the third quarter for Bale. Turned it up a notch. Tyler Williams says, give a shout out to R.J. Gloucester. I will. He's playing a great game. <laughs> Second shot on the way. Off the back of the rim. Raymond with the rebound. He'll give it up to Bell. Here come the Panthers. 
Bell pulls up at the free throw line off the back of the rim. Raymond with the rebound. He'll find Mingo all alone under the board. Got it. 60 to 40 now. Back to 20. Foul at the free throw line. Good pass down low to 12. Got it. Another basket for 12. RJ driving. Good pass to Raymond. We got a foul. Let's see. On number one, that's foul. That'll be his second. Panthers keep it. Brian will bring it in. Got it to Bale. Bale, good pass to Raymond. He lost it, scooped it up, and made it anyway. 62-42. Oh, Val trips. They're going to call a foul on RJ. I don't know. He tripped over RJ. That'll be four on RJ. Miller will check in. RJ will come out with four fouls. They got it in. The Panthers. Miller will steal it. He give it up to Bell, and the Panthers lost it back. 24 with the ball. Back to Val. Long three. Can't get it to go. Bell with a rebound. Long pass to Mingo. Mingo was trying to pass it to Miller. Bile draw a foul. That's his third. That'll put Mingo at the free throw line. First one on the way. Off the back of the rim. Jackson checking back in for Turner. Dulcy getting ready to check in. Mingo got it. See what we got here. Got subs checking in. Here comes Turner now. Jackson with the ball. He'll kick it out to Hillman. Hillman with a three off the back of the rim. Miller with the rebound. He'll give it to Bell. Here come the Panthers. Good job there by Hillman for the steal. 15-footer. Got it. Sixty-three forty-four. now. Panthers lead. Bell with the ball. He'll give it to Bryant. Panthers will pull out and slow it down now. 15 seconds on the shot clock. Plenty of time. Bale with a long three. Overshot it. Rebound Raymond. Panthers get a new shot clock. Oh, it didn't hit the rim. So the referee saying they sh they're going to have to run the shot clock back down. That was probably about, no, they was more than five seconds, but that's what he's going to put on there. You have to look back. That was probably about 12 seconds on the shot clock. Knocked out of bounds. Now it's down to four seconds. They get it to Raymond. Raymond, you got to shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Shot clock violation. So the Panthers will turn it over. Four forty-four to play. He had Raymond having the best game he's had. 
Mingo with the steal, tries to get it to Raymond. Titans save it. 10 will clean it up, put it in, and one. 13, that's Bell, that'll be his third. Hillman with the basket. Hillman with 14 points tonight for Turner. In and out, wouldn't stay. Here come the Panthers. Raymond with the rebound. Bell, long pass to Mingo, and he lays it up and in. Good job, good pass. Mingo with another basket. Boom, Miller slaps it out. They tried to lay it up. Miller was having none of that. Turner keeps it. Raymond will slap it out. Panthers have it. Oh, they get it to Bell. Boom! That is! Bell with a one-hand slam. 67-46. We've just been waiting on him to get it. Turnaround jumper, number five, can't get it. Two with the rebound, it'll roll in and one. Terry with the basket. Number 10, that's Miller, that'll be his second. Posley will check in, Mingo will go out. Mingo's played some great basketball tonight, folks. Fourteen points tonight for Mingo. Got it. Good shot there by number two, Terry. Bryant with the ball back to Posley. Posley, good pass to Miller under the basket. Got it. Great ball movement. Great ball movement for the Panthers. Terry driving to the basket, can't get it to go. Miller and then they tie it up, it'll be a jump ball. Turner will keep the possession. 69-49, Panthers lead by 20. Foul coming back in the game for Turner. Now bringing it in. Long three, Bell slapped at it. Miller has it. Oh, good job there. By number five for Turner, that's Dalsey with the basket. Posley back to Miller, we got a foul. On number 15, Tennille. That'll be his first. They get it into Bell. 69-51. Bryant with the ball, got it to Miller. Miller down low. No foul, there come the Titans. Can't get it to go. Jump ball, please. Where's the jump ball at? They've called it all night. Lays it up, good layup there by Dulce. Come the Panthers. Posley with the ball. Drives in, lays it up, oh, wouldn't roll. Good move by Posley, couldn't get the roll. Beautiful Casey says, boom, you right, darling. He boomed it to the house. You right, Grits ain't grocery, Jimmy. That's why you come to the games and you watch it. McCray says, checking in from Saudi Arabia. We appreciate you tuning in. 
Oh, he didn't want none of that bell was fixing to slap it out. What a move. Didn't make it Posley with the rebound. Five will take it. Dawsey Will can't get it to go. There's finally the basket. Finally, Terry will put it in and get it. All right, we got a timeout with 2.03 to play. 69.55. We'll be back in just a second. Dairy Queen is a proud part of our local communities and is cheering our sports teams on to championship seasons. Drop by before and after the game to say hello to Mr. Ash and his entire crew and enjoy the full Dairy Queen menu including our famous grilled burgers, artisan style sandwiches, and chicken strips. Cool off with our renowned smoothies, slushies, malts, and iced coffees. Try our fabulous desserts and take an ice cream cake home for that special occasion or just to treat the family. Dine in or take out at Dairy Queen locations in Homerville, Blackshire, Folkestone, and Fernandina Beach. See you at the DQ. Lee Engineering and Construction Company in DuPont, Georgia has been a part of the community since 1935 and is proud to support Clinch County Athletics. The prayer of the entire Lee Engineering family is that our Lord and Savior will richly bless our schools, community, and nation. All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. I'm Alan Hanley. Got my buddy Daniel Munzo up here running the camera. Getting ready to take that nap on the way home. All right, here come the Panthers. RJ with the ball. He'll give it to Bryant. All the way across to Bell. Back to RJ. Bryant with the ball pulled up. Can't get it. Rebound in there by Terry. Good steal by Bryant. Oh, they said he stepped on the line. Mm. Coach Terrence just smiling a little bit. Good hustle by Bryant, though. Foul with the ball for Turner. He'll give it up to Terry. Dalsey with the shot, can't get it to go. Peggy says, go Panthers. 69-57. I don't know what we're stopping here for. 112 to play in the game. Panthers are going to get that nasty taste out of their mouth losing to Folkestone and improve with just one region loss. Bryant drives in, can't get it. We got a foul. Oh, he traveled. Okay, he traveled. One minute to play. I want to remind everybody, don't go anywhere. We'll have Coach Terrence on here. Pull up number 10, can't get the roll. Miller with the rebound. RJ with the ball. He'll dribble through. Good ball movement by RJ. Got it over to Bryant. Oh, Bryant knocked out of bounds. We got one down. Man, he went hard into the wall. That is Dulcie. He's up. Man, what a collision. 36 seconds to play. Game's over. Panthers have it. Bale with the ball. Bale pulled back. Three-pointer off the back of the rim. Out of bounds, 25 seconds to play now. King will check in. Turner brings it in. Hillman will bring it down. Hillman's had a good game for Turner. He's the leading scorer. Another long three off to the side. A rebound, big block again by Miller. Two big blocks for Miller tonight. 
RJ back to Bell. Good back door. Miller up and in. And Raymond with a three, and it's going to go off. Panthers will get the win. A big region win in Turner County, 71 to 57. Y'all don't go anywhere. We're going to take a break, and we'll be back with Coach Terrence George, the head coach of the Panthers. We'll be back in just a second. Enjoy the Pizza Inn all-day buffet with more than 40 items featuring salads, pasta, desserts, and pizzas located at 501 South City Boulevard in Waycross. Whether you want to dine in or take out, the Pizza Inn in Waycross is the place to go for wonderful pizza and salad bar. Call 912-809-2411 for takeout orders or drop by for a grand dining experience. The Pizza Inn, Waycross, Georgia. Need a break? Need some quality family time? Get over to Camping World of Valosta right now. Camping World of Valosta can put you in an RV for as little as $5 per day. Make your dreams of camping with your family or a road trip across the USA reality. Experience the freedom that comes with the purchase of an RV from Camping World of Valosta. Whether it is a purchase of an RV, maintenance, service, or camping supplies, Camping World of Valosta can meet all of your RV needs. So don't put your dreams off another day. commitment to convenient health care and the highest quality in pharmacy services, Clinch Memorial Pharmacy offers three convenient ways for you to get your prescriptions. We offer an easy walk-in location near the ER entrance. Our pharmacist is on site, ready to help if you have any questions. With our curbside pickup options, we will bring the prescriptions to your car. Just call ahead. We also offer a delivery service for prescriptions for patients in Clinch County. Make the change today. Call 912 470-2359 to learn more. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill, located at 31 East Dame Avenue, Homerville, has the best food and atmosphere anywhere around. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill has a great lunch and dinner menu with a wide variety of your favorite food including the perfectly grilled steak, wraps, sandwiches, chicken and salads. Big Daddy's in Homerville also has your favorite drink to go with your meal. Drop by Big Daddy's in Homerville, you won't be disappointed. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill on 84 in Homerville for the best food and drinks around. This is Alan Hanley and I want to tell you about Dre's Snack Shack. Dre specializes in chicken wings, barbecue, sausage, hot dogs, hamburgers, salads, and a variety of other mouth-watering menu items. So y'all come on down and see Dre at Dre's Snack Shack. He can handle all your catering needs also. The good thing is he stays open late at night after the game. So please come in and see Dre at Dre Snack. All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. I'm Alan Henley. I got the head basketball coach, my buddy, my best friend, Terrence George, man. Hey, thank you for having me, man. Enjoy uh, days like this, you know. Man, when you can come to Turner and win 71 to 57, you, you've done something. Uh, 
Number one, we got a bad taste out of our mouth from Tuesday. That's right. Got the bad taste out. You know, it's always difficult to play up here because they play, you know, when it comes to us, they play us extremely hard. And, uh, you know, we just want to come out, play the best we can, uh, and try to handle, you know, the atmosphere and the, and the speed of the game in which, we, you know, they play up here. And I think we overall we did a fairly good job. You know, we had built a decent lead right there. Uh, they made a nice little run to try to cut into it, but we was able to maintain. Yeah, the first half, man, I don't know what you said at halftime. It looked like a totally <laughs> – and not to take nothing. Turner played hard in the first half. They run out of gas, I think, Yeah. later in. Man, they're so quick, like you say, and – and that, that'll wear you down some. That's right. They played extremely hard, man, that first half. Uh, you know, just in the locker room at halftime, I told them, I said, there's, there's a few things we need to clean up, you know. Uh, we need to cut back on the turnovers. We had, you know, uh, uh, quite a few turnovers in the first half that I thought happened at timely, you know, at points in the game that was real costly at times, you know. And, uh, you know, we talked about cleaning that up, and I think we did a better job with that in the second half. Well, I can tell you what, Mingo and Raymond playing some basketball. They played some tonight. They're getting better game to game. Mingo's stepping in. He's doing a good job. He is, Our man. Our ball movement tonight was so good under the basket. Man, it was tremendous. You know, Mingo's one of those freshmen, you know, before we started this season, uh, we had high hopes for him. We expected him to come in and do a lot of good things for us. Uh, we expect him to contend for freshman of the year for, for our uh, region, you know. Mm -hmm. And so he's coming out, man, these past couple games, you know, he's coming out. He, he struggled a little bit against Charlton. Uh, and, you know, being a freshman, that's expected that's right. for the magnitude right. of that particular game. But I think he made up for tonight, man. He man. had a great game tonight. He did. And, man, that even sets up a bigger game. I know we go to Statenville Friday, but we got to go to the doghouse Saturday. And you know how it is in Lakeland anytime you go to L.A. <laughs> yeah, that's right, man. And, and again, you know, we'll we'll prepare uh, for that particular game. We won't look past L because we know they're going to play as best right. they probably, you know, as best as they possibly can. Uh, they always do that, you know. And so we don't want to necessarily look past them, but we we look to be ready to play Lanier. Uh, it's going to be a big game. Uh, should be a an electric atmosphere. Always. And man, we are looking forward to it just just as much as they are. You <laughs> that's know? right. That's right. <laughs> Always a battle when you go to Lanier and Clinch. Man, let me ask you, Terrence R.J. They called two fouls. What was the foul for shooting the three? I mean, what? I mean, I, I, I didn't see nothing. What? Because I, I seen your reaction because you seen the foul. I saw the foul. What? What did? What was the foul? You know, when you're shooting, you have landing space that is allowed to you, and the defender has to allow you to land in that space. All I right, got so, you. Um, and so what R.J. was doing was sticking his leg out like an trying NBA Trying to get a foul. He was trying to draw a foul. Okay, I got you. Now, that makes sense. And so, therefore, the – He done it back to back. Yes, these <laughs> officials tonight wasn't going for that, you know. That's right. So, you know, I told him, I said, hey, this is not the NBA. They're not going for that. You have got to land in a spot, you know, that is allowed for you to land in. You cannot stick your leg out. See, you know? down here I thought he drawed the foul, but they called it on him, and I, you know, I didn't know it. Then down here – two or three possessions it was again and yep. then I see you pull him out and I said well he must have done something yeah, wrong. He, yeah. <laughs> you know and there was no argument to the referee you know I'm like I saw it you know I'm standing on the sideline I saw it you know? but man uh, uh, did great Mingo put up some points tonight uh, of course uh, Bale turned it on man in the third quarter he come in Lit up. He finished up with 18 points. What I got, and then a uh, Mingo was 17 points. Yes, tonight, man, that's man. big for a freshman, man. And that's Miller big. and and uh, Burns down low. They're getting better. They're work, man. They, you know, you like it when when you when you don't tell a big drop off when one comes in from the other. That's right. That uh, you, you know, know and, and that means a lot, man. That's right. To have depth and be able to play kids like that, man, it it, it is tremendous, you know, and. You know, we had Bryant go down in the first quarter with an ankle right there, and, you know, he had to spend a little time on the bench. And so, you know, we struggled a little bit trying to get our wits about RJ got stage, in you know. foul trouble early on, man. Trouble, but, uh, but, you know, we managed. We came through, man, and the boys did a great job of sharing the ball, man. I can't wait to get the report to see how many assists we had oh, in this particular Bell, game. there's no telling how many Bell had. That's the, right. And, the, man, just uh, the long passes – that were completed yes. and, and finished. You know, usually when you have a long pass, one out of five, but we were right on time tonight. We're Just time great tonight. ball movement, man. You're doing a good job, Coach. Uh, we'll have this Tuesday off, man, and we'll be in Eccles County out in Statenville Friday. All right. Looking forward to it, man. All right, man. A good week of practice. Good job tonight, Coach. We appreciate you. Yes, sir. Thank coming you on having. here. Yeah, man. All right, folks. That's going to wrap us out. Another big win by the Panthers. Here tonight, 71 to 57. I want to remind everybody the coaches 
interview is sponsored by Tom Kennedy for Mayor. We appreciate that. Before I got to get out of here, I need to give a shout out to all our sponsors. We have Homerville Jewelers, Clinch Memorial Hospital Community Paramedicine Program, Dre Snack, y'all be careful, baby. All right, Dre Snack Shack, Homerville Fargo Feed and Seed, Clinch Memorial Pharmacy, Clayton Homes of Waycross, Clinch Memorial Family Practice, Pete's Inn of Waycross, Big K and Lee Engineering in DuPont, Georgia, Savage Turner Law Firm in Savannah, Georgia, Camping World of Alasta, Napa Auto, Big Daddy's on Highway 84, Walker Jones of Waycross, Burt CPA, Lutz Brown Insurance, Moore Farms in Maynard, Georgia for your best produce in the world, Huey's One Stop, Douglas Metal, Richard's Meat and Seafood, and Famous 